Okay, so I went to the camera store, found out that the CF Fast card that I ordered was for a Sony and not for a Nikon. It wasn't a Type B CF Express card, so I had to get two of them. But now I got the uh, Z8, pretty well handled, 320 gigabyte. CF Express card with uh, 256 gigabytes and they're both by ProMaster SD cards. One's a CF Express Type-P, the other one's a SD card V90. So one has a 256 gig SD card and one has a 320 CF Express card on the Z8. So this is the Z6 II. This is the ZF, right? This is the Z5, right to the ZF. This is the other ZF, but to the left of the Z6 II. Keeping track now, right? Oh, and this is side shot, Z7 II. Forty five point seven megapixel camera. And uh, so is this one. This is the twenty six millimeter on here. I took it out of crop mode. I put it in full frame mode, but this is the Z eight. So I got the handle on it and I'm gonna or the hand grip, the um what can I say? The hand strap. Okay, I'm going to leave it on that camera. So, with all the luck that I've had for the past three weeks, I got two ZFs. I got a Z8. I couldn't believe it. And then lightning struck a fourth time. Right. Let's zoom it down a little bit. Or is it kind of hard to see with all that flashing? Let me help a little bit more. So the nice thing about having a product review table is you can size some things up. You can center your picture best as possible. A little story behind this, folks. So I went to get the uh, CF Express card because uh, 128 gigabytes wasn't going to handle it. I did have a 512 gigabyte, so I wanted at least a 256, right? Well, they didn't have it, but they had a 320, so I got that. Anyway, make a long story short. The one that I ordered... Uh, it was kind of like a type A card for the Sony. So I ordered the wrong card. But the salesman put me straight. And I was noticing this box of used cameras. And I said, this isn't your rental. And I said, no, this is for sale. I said, what is it? He said, a Z9. Really? Someone brought that back? He says, yeah. He preferred his uh, DSLR 3400 instead. He opened it up. I think he put the battery in or charged it, whatever, and returned it. And I says, oh, $5,500 camera, and he'd rather have his DSLR? He says, yeah, some, some people are, you know, have their favorites. So I says, uh, how much? He told me, I bought it, just for a guy opening it up, didn't remove the uh, little sticky uh, protective for the LCD screen, and uh, got it for a thousand dollars less. I got it for 4500 Couldn't pass it up. Brand new, 
I think he turned it on, maybe put in the date and stuff. That was it. So now we're going to do an unboxing of the number one premium Nikon camera. So within three weeks, I've gotten two ZF. I got a Z8, and now I have a Z9. Unreal, folks. How lucky. So let's open it up. I already registered it. There's manuals and stuff. And I got the CF Express and the Rugged. They're both by ProMaster, right? So they call it Velocity for the Type B um, CF Express card. And then they got a V90 uh, rug card, 512 gigabyte. They're both fast. So I remove the documentation, registration. Let's open this bag. Oh, yeah. I can remember. Okay. So he showed me, yeah, that's the camera part, that this guy opened it up and we're looking at it. So I think he did use the battery charger, which is this thing, and it's a plug, okay? So you plug it in, and then you charge it through the USB-C. Okay, a little bit different, yeah, I can deal with it. And then this thing is the battery charger. <laughs> So, USB-C goes in there. Okay. They have a USB 3 to USB-C charger. This came with the ZA2. So, this is cable management. You know, uh, I got a full HDMI uh, cable and Stuff. And then, of course, you got your camera strap. So I got all this stuff in here. Yeah, I'll leave this in here. Because I, I got enough cables with my camera bags and stuff. And I always leave the packaging and stuff in the box. And if I decide to sell, they got everything. So we opened this up, right? I took it out, looked at it. There you go, folks. 4,500 bucks. You might have taken this off. You never know. You probably did. Okay. And the battery is in there. So let's see if it turns on. Yes, it does. Okay. So that works. Let's open this thing up. Now I do have a hard time opening this hood up. There we go. So, see, uh, Let's take two. Caution hot card. Okay, what, that's one. Oh, it takes two CF Express cards. I thought it took an SD card. Okay, my bad. No, I'll just go to this one and get another one. Okay, so there's two CF Express cards. I wasn't expecting that. Can I exit, uh, insert another card? Well, let's format it. Menu. Menu. No. Yeah, turn it on. Okay, menu. Um, yeah, I haven't set anything up, but he did turn it on. Okay. 
There we go. Slot one, yes. Uh oh. They put it in the wrong way? Okay. You know what? Hope I didn't get a bad. See ya. Let's put in number two. Turn it on. Yeah. yeah, there we go. You gotta put it in two. Full format. Yes, trash can. So that's different. It goes into slot two instead of slot one. That's good to know. Look at that. Microphone. Quality. White balance. I. I. So I see. Oh. So when you turn it this way. So I have to redo the manuals and or the menus and stuff. I'll go into that. It's in camera mode. Four K thirty. Uh, aperture and your focus, I guess. I got seven hours and fifty-five minutes on that card. Unreal. So I'll turn it off. The battery is fully charged. And if you take the uh, screen out, okay, I haven't taken the screen out, but if it's like the Z8, yeah. So it's tilty left and right, okay? Yeah, you probably got tired of the menu. All right. So let, let's go to the side. You open up the uh, door battery, go like that, and I think you turn it and then you pull, and here's the battery. So I'll need to get another one. Just turn it clockwise and then put the slab down. There's a button there, button here. So if I'm holding it like this, yeah. So I'm gonna, I, I usually hold the camera like this, but I guess I have to get used to this. Um, Joystick here, joystick here, so I have to get used to this too. That's different than, look, back dial, dial, front dial, front dial. Function one, two, and three, and there's a the function four. So E8 only has function three, which is right there. I, joystick, autofocus on display, camera, your yeah that's a switch for that this I don't know what it's for have to look at that that's for uh, looking through the viewfinder trash can the mode I'm getting used to that bracketing multiple shots I have to look at that I know about the mode. Record video ISO, exposure compensation, on, off, and that's for the lighting on the back. See? If I turn off the lights, it, it lights up. Isn't that something? I turn it off, turn it on. Isn't that something? I like that. Okay. So, 
I'm going to have to put a lens on here. Well, let me put this camera down. It's all unboxed. Okay, what am I forgetting? Put this down. Put the manuals and stuff in here. learning curve for me. Oh my. Yeah. Full HDMI, USB-C. Okay. Headphone, mic. I think that's network. Yep, network. Should we do those buttons? Oh. Okay. I see a wheel here. Oh, button. There we go. So I have to get used to this. Multiple shots, timer, horizontal, length, you know, uh, turn it, shutter. That's what I think is. Well, I'll just have to read. So I'm excited. Got the battery charger, so it, it's fully charged. I'm used to uh, SD cards, maybe one SD. See if Express, but it has two. So, uh, anyhow, I have to order another one. Yeah, let me pause this. If I can get my bearings right with the uh, mouse. Well, I guess I put the Planet 135 millimeter on there, and I'm going to do a shoot. I'm debating if I should take off that sales tag. Now I'll just put it in the box. Can't believe it. Got it a thousand dollars off. I did buy the warranty. So, anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, wish me luck. And uh, remember, stay safe, keep smiling. Until next time, I shall see you then. Goodbye, folks.